Wow, what a wild day here in the apocalypse. I have my second shower in a month. Oh my God, better than sex and almost as expensive, but oh, it was wonderful. And I uh, had a wild day debating with friends that all this was gonna blow over and we could just all go find new housing and start a new life in 10 days. Not my experience so far, especially since I started the day with a cop stalking us in a Freddy's parking lot because we had been parked there for two hours while Freddy's helped us charge our phone and I spent money in there. And uh, Flying J got snippy with us when I charged phones there after spending 30 bucks there on gas and a shower and coffee. So yeah, it's getting tight out here. So um, I need law enforcement or the government to tell me and the thousands of people living in their cars in this country what stay at home means when you live in your car, some of us with children, and you don't have a bathroom or a place to charge a device or a way to get a beverage without interacting with the public all day, every day. So please help us with some guidelines because it's not like we're just gonna go away. We're not going to a homeless shelter where they've herded all those people into a pile. There's no six feet in any homeless shelter I've ever been in. So they're just all gonna die together, thank you, no. So we could use a little guidance. I miss my harp. I want to play for you guys. Fair warning, it will not stay in tune for more than five minutes. Uh, I've beat the crap out of this thing the last four years on the street, which is not what it was really intended for, so she's doing her best. But this amazing Disney song is about dealing with your grief, and if you keep believing, the dreams that you dream will come true. And have a pleasant good night from Harp Lady and Raven. God bless.